Hello everyone, you read the latest market news on April the 23rd, 2021. Biden to set highest gain tax for wealthy. President Joe Biden will roll out a plan to raise taxes on the wealthiest Americans, including the largest ever increase in investment growth taxes to fund about $1 trillion in child care, universal preschool education and paid time off for worker sources familiar with the proposal set. The plan is part of a White House push for a radical overhaul of the U.S. tax system to make rich people and big companies pay more and help pay for Biden's ambitions view. The proposal would raise the marginal income tax rate from 30 37% to 39.6%. It will also nearly double capital gains taxes to 39.6% for people earning more than $1 million. That will be the highest tax rate on investment earnings, which has been paid mostly by the wealthiest Americans since the 1920s. In the post-World War II era, that rate did not exceed 33.8%. Daimler lifts forecast despite global chip deficit. Automaker Mercedes-Benz Daimler AG on Friday raised its profit forecast for 2021 but warned that global semiconductor chip shortage could continue to affect sales in the second quarter. The chip shortage has forced a number of major automakers to cut production. General Motors Co., Stellantis, Ford, Mother Co. and Daimler's German rival Volkswagen AG. Earlier this week, Daimler cut working hours for 18,500 employees and said it would temporarily hold production at two plants in Germany because of that issue. But the German automaker said it still expects operating profits to be well above 2020 this year as the global economy recovers from the devastating coronavirus pandemic. Daimler said it now expects adjusted margins from Mercedes's car and van business to be 10% to 12%, up from a previous forecast of 8% to 10%. Bitcoin falls below $50,000 ahead of a tough week. The value of Bitcoin fell below the $50,000 mark on Thursday night. It traded at $48,815.1 on Friday, down 10.06% on the day. This was the largest one-day loss percentage since January the 21st. The world's largest digital coin rose to $42,000 at the beginning of the year, but then lost ground. A new rally began in February. Bitcoin broke through the $48,000 mark for the first time when electric car maker Tesla announced its $1.5 billion dollars coin purchase on February the 9th. After that, it reached $57,000 on February the 20th. This week could be a tough one for Bitcoin, but then there will be a slight correction, says Joseph Edwards of cryptocurrency broker Enigma Securities. Meanwhile, Diversify Cryptocurrency Exchange co-founder Ross Middleton commented that this week's sell-off is a result of last week's weakening activity. Stock markets trade mixed amid U.S. tax worries. Global equities were mixed on Friday, reacting to gains in Chinese blue chips and the European Central Bank's decision to maintain stimulus. Investors largely ignored the impact of a potential U.S. tax hike on capital gains. In Asia, MSCI's broadest index of Asia-Pacific stocks outside Japan shook off early small losses on Friday and rose 0.43 percent. Shares of Chinese blue chip stocks rose 0.51 percent, supported by greenback and healthcare stocks. Japan's Nikkei stock index was down 0.57 percent. Equity markets in Europe were expected to open lower after two days of gains. In early European trade, in Eurostax 50 region-wide futures were down 0.25 percent and FTSC futures were down 0.43 percent. The ECB decided to leave policy in place despite its prediction of a strong rebound. In an overnight blow to stock market sentiment, the administration of U.S. President Joe Biden is reportedly pushing to raise the capital gains tax to nearly 40 percent for the wealthy, nearly double the the current rate, the Dow Jones fell 0.94%.